In this email tutorial, I'm going to show you how to configure Outlook 2007 to connect to our email servers. So first I'm going to go to Tools, then Account Settings. Under the Email tab, I'm going to click on the New button to create a new email account. I'm going to then type in the name I want people to see when they receive my email. I'm going to want to type in my email address. and then type in my password. I'm going to want to tick the box that says manually configure server settings or additional server types and then click next. On this next page I'm going to want to choose internet email connect to your POP, IMAP or HTTP server On the email settings page, you have the option of selecting a POP3 account or an IMAP account. For the purposes of this tutorial, I'm going to be selecting a POP3 account. In the incoming mail server field, I'm just going to want to type POP dot my domain name. So in this example, my domain name is example.au.com. So I'm going to type in POP dot example.au.com. In the outgoing mail server field, I'm going to want to type SMTP dot my domain name. So since my domain name is example.au.com, I'm going to be typing in smtp.example.au.com. In the logon information area, I'm going to want to type in my authentication details. That would normally be my full email address. And the email password I created on the email server. Before doing anything else, I'm going to want to go to more settings, click on the outgoing server tab, tick the box that says my outgoing server requires authentication, ensure that the radio option that says use same settings as my incoming mail server is selected, then go to the advanced tab, check that the incoming server port is 110, modify the outgoing server port to 587 and then click OK. To test if my email settings are correct I can click on test account settings and Outlook will attempt to connect to the server attempt to send an email. You can see here both tests were successful and now I can click next and finish. So now I have an email account here if I ever need to change the settings again I can always just go back to Tools, Account Settings, click on the email account, and click on Change. And I can modify the settings anytime I need to. Thank you for watching this tutorial and have a good day.